Hi folks, and welcome back to another version of iBreak. I thought I'd take a second to pull off my mask. I'm in an exam room all by myself here at Armstrong and Small Eye Care Center in Winnipeg, Manitoba, Canada. And uh, I thought I'd do this quick video because I'm actually having an ocular migraine. I've got lots of patients that have these. I've only had two in my life, now three. Uh, and so what's happening to me right now is I've got a lot of jagged, scintillating kaleidoscope lights that seem to all be stemming from my right side. Uh, so, yeah, my right side. And uh, if I close my eyes, I can still see it. If I close my right eye, I actually see it out of my left. So I'm getting it from both eyes. So this is actually a, my brain playing a trick on me. Lots of people get these in a classic migraine. Some people will get these kind of aura type situations, same thing. For me, I don't really have much of a headache. I had a little, most of my headaches stem from neck, but I tend not to be too headachey, thankfully. One of the lucky ones, I suppose. Uh, but it can also almost feel like it's coming from my eye. This is actually, again, my brain is playing a trick on me that I'm seeing these lights when I'm really, there's no lights. Uh, so these are often the questions that we'll ask when people call in with flashes and floaters, uh, or they're thinking they're having something retinal when in fact they're actually having something that's related to their brain. We don't know exactly where ocular migraines come from or why they happen, but definitely there's some major triggers. And for me today, dehydration. So I just hammered down about a liter of water, hoping that that reduces the time. These usually last anywhere from seconds uh, to, I've had some people even, you know, 30 to 60 minutes. Um, but some of the other triggers other than dehydration might be certain foods. I have certain patients that it's chocolate, uh, could be dar darker wines will do it, uh, stronger cheeses, onions, and interestingly enough, sometimes lights. I have had definitely patients that will walk into certain stores, especially big box stores that have these bright lights, and the light will hit them weird, or even in their basement and something coming through the window, and it'll trigger these, what we call the ocular migraines. Again, lots of times not associated with a headache at all, and I have a little bit of one right now, but I just want to share it with you because I'm actually experiencing one, and I don't get these too often, so it's quite a little bit of a show that I've got going on right here, and hopefully now that I've pounded some water and hopefully decreased some of my dehydration after having two big cups of coffee, uh, and I actually slept pretty well, but lack of sleep is one thing that could do it as well, and then um, the last one that I would say would be caffeine, so all these things that can uh, cause these. If you have any questions, feel free to give us a call and let us know when these are happening and, and we'll double check you. We'll make sure that everything's okay. Take care and be wise. Take care of your eyes.